Hey homies, welcome back to Something New Saturday. Today's Something New is a stamp and die set from the Gemini people. Bought this at Tuesday morning last week in their, you know, going out of business sale. It's a cute little bunny set. Now, I don't usually do like a interactive cards, but I really like the stamp set in this and I just thought it was very sweet. So let's get this opened up. Let's see what we got here. These are like Fort Knox to get into, man. Okay, so we've got a cute little bunny stamp set. You got your bun, I'm all ears, a cupcake, a carrot to a sweet friend, some background speckles, grass. I'll catch you if you fall. Cute. And then here we have the dice. So we have our bunny, a carrot, a cupcake, and then a circle to cut out. So the circle is to cut some foam to attach to the penny. You need two pennies to make this work. Well, what do you say we make a sliding Easter card? Okay, I've got my card base. I've got my panel. I've got my two pennies to make the mechanism. And now I'm going to cut the slider section out. So you determine where you want your bunny to slide. I'm gonna put it about here. All right, now we're gonna decorate our card panel. I'm gonna stamp the grass and then blend a little ink in with it. And we're gonna use Simon Hurley Litter Gator. Next, I'm going to take this Lawn Fawn stencil and I'm going to stencil some clouds and then uh, ink blend the entire top half with clear skies. I love this color too. Simon did a good job with his colors. That is for sure. So we're just going to do the clouds. We've got three clouds, and we're just going to blend over the whole thing with some clear skies. That's cute. And then I'm going to go around the edge with the ink pad. Get a little more color on the edges there. Do the blue on the top and the green on the bottom half. Just there's a little more contrast when it's against the card. There we go. Okay, so here we've got our panel and the card base. Now it says the next step is to use foam tape on the back of your panel. So we'll do foam tape around the edges. I'm going to do a little extra for reinforcement just to make me feel better. Probably doesn't need it, but it'll make me feel better to have it. Got to be kind of like this. Now we need to stamp our bunny because he's so cute. All right, let's stamp our little bunny. I think I will send this card to my grandson. We're going to stamp with memento so we can use a little bit of alcohol marker. Bunny, bunny. There 
there's a bunny. Okay, we're just gonna do a little pink and a little gray. So let's get a little pink in his ears. Pink in there. Come back in with my lighter again. little bit of this really light A little shadow there. Come back in with that again. Just a little bit of color so he's not completely stir white. And we'll cut him out. <laughs> oh my goodness, look how cute he is. Oh, he's so sweet. Okay, so okay, it's time to put our front on and get our penny trapped in there. Alright, I'm gonna put some bear glue on so I have a little wiggle room to make sure I get it straight. Okay, so that circle die is to cut foam for your penny, but it's a little too big for the spot, so I'm going to cut it down. I hope that it still works okay. So I've got my fun foam there. Some double sided tape on it, I think, instead of glue. Make sure all the edges are up on the foam. Don't want it sticking where it shouldn't. tape on there. And then we'll put the other penny on. Press it down really well. I'm going to 
put tape on that penny to adhere the bun bun. Oh, Charlie will like that. Okay. And I do have this other Easter step in my stash. This is uh, close to my heart. And I think I want to put Somebody Loves You on the front. Like right about there. And I'm just going to stamp it on a scrap. I want to stamp it with clear sky. Trim this out. And we'll flag this end. Just add it right here. And we'll stamp Happy Easter inside. We'll use Later Gator. Perfect to our four-year-old. <laughs> and we'll use clear skies for the happy. Ah, there we go. Alrighty, friends. Here's this month's project for Something New Saturday. Our Something New is a Gemini... Crafter's Companion stamp and die set. Picked it up a Tuesday morning. Blacked out because you can't return it because it's clearance because they're closing down. Cute little Easter bunny set. I have a thing for Easter bunnies. <laughs> All bunnies in general. Just did some real simple coloring. I'm going to send this to my grandson. So you make your panel, you add the cut piece. Pennies are what makes them move. But I think he's precious. I did pull out some reinforcements for some Easter sentiments. Somebody loves you and happy Easter are from close to my heart. But a nice little set for six bucks for sure. Well, actually it was less than that because it was 20% off. Um, like I said in the beginning, I don't really do interactive cards. But I thought my grandson might enjoy this. So, hope you have a lovely day. Remember, be excellent to each other. Go make something. Bye-bye.